Yo, what is up you guys? Lord Lightning here, back at again with another video. This is part 1 of The Last of Us Part 2. This is a new gameplay walkthrough. We're going to continue, I'm hoping this continues the story of The Last of Us, which we got done doing, I believe, the week before Christmas. Yeah, I believe so. Uh, anyway. We're not going to talk much during, you know, the usual things. I did get a lot of, you know, support during the last gameplay, so I hope you guys show a lot more support in this gameplay too. But we're going to check our settings real quick and make sure subtitles are on, because sometimes they're never really on. Okay, story dialogue, additional ads. Oh, enable subtitles for additional enemy dialogue while in stealth in combat. Yeah, I should probably add that. Just to be safe. Uh. Hmm. Let me check the controls here real quick too. Let me see if the controls are pretty much the same here. Yeah, they look pretty much the same as before. Yep, pretty much. Anyway, we're just going to get straight into the story here. No point messing around here. Very light. Oh, they have a lot more settings here. We can choose between the most difficult most challenging and realistic experience, listening mode, hub mode, and other gameplay elements are altered in this game mode. I definitely want to do a, you know, speed run of that if you guys are really interested in doing that. Anyway, we probably will play on a um, moderate mode because I think, like, if we play too easy, it just, you know, be not that, you know. Just not that fun. So we're going to play on normal difficulty because I'm pretty sure this is normal. Anyway, let's check everything here. Permadeath. Permadeath adds additional challenge by limiting how much progress will be saved on death and can only be added when you're starting a new game. Whole game. You know, save progress. Wait, hold on here. Whole game, your save progress will be res completely reset on death. Ooh, dang. Per act, progress will be reset to the beginning of the act on death. Approximately two to five hours of gameplay time per chapter. Progress will be set to the beginning of chapter on death. Approximately... Three to sixty minutes of game time. You will be unable to manually save your game. Quitting the game or exiting the application while in a dangerous position will be treated as a death. Ooh. I actually would very much like to try that too. But we don't need the um, aiming and look inverted anyway. Anyway, let's just start. You have select model, change level can be changed at any time in option and difficulty. Okay. I do hope that this um, boat has something to do with it anyway. I hope that we do get to play a lot more as Ellie. But I don't mind playing as Joel. But I do wonder who is going to be the antagonist for this game. Like, I don't know if it's going to be an antagonist or a group or something like that anyway. Tell me what you guys think, to be honest. You guys can tell me in the comments before. I do hope you guys, you know, really do enjoy this first part as, you know, I really want to continue this game. Uh, Sony... Alter Active Entertainment presents a Naughty Dog game. A 
I'm off. I don't know what happened. Hey, it's Joe. I was supposed to take her to the fireflies and walk away. You go halfway across the country with someone. She needed her immunity to mean something. Maybe I was starting to buy into that old cure business. Maybe I just wanted to do right by her. And then we made it. We found the firefly. It wasn't like that before. Because of her. They were actually going to make a cure. The only catch. It would kill her. Sweet Jesus. Doctor! What are you doing? I won't let you take her. This is our future. Think of all the lives we'll save. Jesus Christ, Joe. What do you do? I saved her. But at what cost? a lot. What does Ellie know? I told her they just ran some tests. I told her her immunity meant nothing. And she believed you? Didn't say otherwise. <sighs> we should head back. So he did tell Tommy. <sighs> oh, we actually get to. Do we actually. Oh, we actually do get to move him. I didn't expect this much action. Well. This amount of actual gameplay so quickly. Still. I'm not gonna look around in this area because there's probably nothing in here. Because it is a beginning area, but you know. Still. I get why he did it. But still. When you mellow over something like that, you know, I guess he was in the heat of the moment. 
but still. Wow, it's a lot bigger. Yeah, it's definitely a lot bigger than we saw in the last game. Still, anyway. I get it, he did it for the reasons that he said he did, but still. And Mylene had the same reasons. One to save many and, you know. Joe just didn't want to lose anyone else. I don't think you can really blame Joel, but at the same time, the way he did it is just, you know, I think it's just morally wrong. I think he was talking, to, I think he told Tommy just to see if he actually would get some, like, another opinion on the map. But no, Nelly, she might eventually find out. I don't know how she, he might overhear or what, but still. I kind of feel like this game might, you know, have Joel deal with the consequences of what he did in the last game. In the finale of the it's last okay. game, anyway. You go on. You sure? Yeah. Right. About what we were talking about earlier. Can't say I'd have done different. I'll take it to the grave if I have to. Hmm. I'll see you later. <laughs> mm. I like Tommy. Never got to just see him much in the last game. Like, he only had, like, a small section, but... I do hope he has a much bigger role in this game now. Still, I really think Joel's gonna have to deal with the consequences of what he did. Oh, is this her? Hey, I think it is. There's our girl. I gave Ellie a lot of bad rap in the last game, but... Oh. Ooh, he's talking. Ellie? Give me a heart attack. I tried knocking, but hey. Hey. What's up, Joel? Just checking in. Folks are you know, talking about how impressed they are with you and how well you're. Helping out. It's good. Yeah. Tommy and I went out riding the other day, and he, uh, <laughs> he told me a joke, and I, I thought about you. It's, um, oh, shoot, now I forgot it. Uh, something about a clock. How do you... Joel, it's, uh, it's pretty late, and I gotta... 
get up in a few hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. And I'm, I'm going to get out of your hair. Just, um, I, w- I want to show you something. Just give me one second. I think she knows something's up. What's this? Ooh. Some folks call this thing here a guitar. Funny. That looks really nice. Looks like garbage, but okay. after you clean it, it does look really nice. Okay. <laughs> Promise me that you won't laugh. I won't laugh. I won't. I'm trusting you. Wait, we actually get to, you know. Oh, this is kind of fun. Oh. didn't suck. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take what I can get. She's yours. No. No, 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 no. I don't know the first thing I about this. I promised that I'd teach you how to play. You did. What do you say, tomorrow night, first lesson? Deal. Okay. (laughs) Okay. Did... Do you remember the joke? What is the downside to eating a clock? It's time consuming. (laughs) That's so dumb. (laughs) Yeah. Good night, kiddo. There's the title screen. (sighs) What? 
Oh, the time skip? Hey. Morning. Sorry, I totally overslept. Just give me a minute and I'll get dressed. I heard you had quite a night after I left. I... She kissed me. It was just Dina being Dina. She didn't mean anything by it. I was talking about your fight with Seth. Wait. You kissed Dina? Ooh. Oh. Dang. I thought this was... We're broken up one week and you make a move on my girl? No. <sighs> she was probably just trying to make you jealous. I didn't... I would never... <sighs> Fuck, this is awkward. I'm messing with you, man. <laughs> I don't care. Get dressed. <sighs> You're the worst. Mm. It's kind of fucked up you did that. <sighs> Bruh. Get your stuff together while we're late. Oh, we're playing as Ellie now? Smells fine. Ugh. So tired. Where is her clothes? Okay. That's a jacket. Okay. Oh, a new pistol. Is she wearing pants? Okay. Wasn't sure if she was or not. Uh, that should be everything, right? Right. Hey, is Joel up? And the classic switchblade. That sucks. Yeah. Can't imagine they got much sleep. Definitely not as much as you. Shut up. I was just about to get up. I was. <laughs> you got everything? Yes. So she lives in a shed Ed, now. You're the talk of the town this morning. <sighs> what? Let me see if I got this right. You kissed Dina. <sighs> she kissed me. Which triggered Seth to call you a not so nice word. Yep. Then Joel decked him. More of a push. And then you got mad at Joel. That part confused me. It was a strange night, man. Sounds exciting. Sorry, I missed it. Huh. I do hope we get to find out what happened, you know, the following night. Maria wants a word with you. Who? Where is she? The diner. Oh, is this about Seth? No clue. Just tell her you never saw me. Nope. Where's your fucking loyalty? Excuse me? If I remember cor correctly, Maria was the leader hey, of the town. So, we're okay, right? You and me? Yeah, of course. Dina and I are done. I know. It's just, I don't want you to think. Ellie, we're cool. Promise. Okay. Uh. Hey, can we go in here? Uh, I guess not. Thought you would. Ooh, doggy ears. Oh, we gotta pet the doggos. Hey, old timer. Yeah, get a good scratch. Mm, bruh. Got oh, he's pet the doggos. Hey, Jesse. Oh, hi. <laughs> the tipsy bison. Okay. Want to grab some breakfast? No. Where's Maria? In the back. Hmm. Excuse me. Ellie. There you are. Come here. Ooh. Seth's got something he wants to say to you. I don't want to hear what that bigot has to say. Do it for me. Please. <sighs> Fine. 
Seth. Seth, come here. Hey. Uh, look, last night I was, uh, I was drinking too much. Sure. I'm trying to say I'm sorry. Maria tells me that you and Dean are headed out. I, uh, made you some sandwiches. Okay. Or steak. Thank you, Seth. Yeah, well, uh, you be safe out there. Yep. I appreciate that. What you got there? Bacon sandwiches. Mm. Smells good. <laughs> you sure? It's fine. Let me walk you out. Okay. Who would give up a steak sandwich in the middle of lowly apocalypse? When you go out, I want you to trade off with Tommy and Joel. Those boys have been up for far too long. Where do I meet them? You go up to the Northwest Lookout. They're scheduled to arrive later today. But watch yourself. I mean, there's too many sightings of infected recently. Hmm. Of course. I was going to check out the creek trails. I'll need someone else to cover it. Ellie, you know the creek trails? Not really. Dean has done it a bunch. I'll have the two of them take. Well, that solves that. Ellie, can I talk to you for a sec? Okay. So, look, I don't know what's going on with you and Joel. <sighs> Maria. Guy really cares about you. And I'm sure he didn't mean to. We're fine. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Sorry to pry. Be safe. Thanks. Yo, Dina! Assignments! <clears throat> Just give me a minute! We get your girlfriend to the stables, please. Oh my God. Hey, Dina. Can I talk to you? <laughs> hey, guys. I'm tapping out. Come on. For how long? This is Ooh. Dina. Hey. Hey. Um. I just want to say sorry for running off last night. Oh, that's it's okay. I totally get it. I <laughs> I just I felt bad. Why? I cuz I started the whole thing and I just I shouldn't have kissed you in front of all of those people no, and No, you were drunk. It's fine. Well, still, I just I don't want you to think No, I'm not reading into it or anything. Just You know what I love about you? How you let me finish my sentences. All right. Well, we should probably get going. Yeah. Ow! What the fuck? I'm not even playing. Cause you're a chicken. You're a chicken. <laughs> I hate this kid. Oh, so much. you better. You wanna fuck him up? <laughs> yeah, I do. Game you on. You better run, you little shits. Holy shit! Get to cover. Go, go. <laughs> ah, gotcha. We're on the board, suckers. Eat that! <laughs> Fuck yeah! I, I mean, frick! Don't tell your mom! Ow! Damn! Arm on that kid! Oh. I'm gonna come over there and fight you, like, for real! Oh, I'm coming for you, Tiny! You can't get me! <laughs> Ow! Uh -huh. I know where you live, Alex! <laughs> oh, suck it! Sneaky. No, your parents don't know you. You suck. 
Not my shirt. In your face. Stove, eat stove. Eat stove. Shit. Oh, dang it. No. Gotcha. Ha. <laughs> Gotcha. Nope. <laughs> Eat it, shrimps. Hey. There we go. <laughs> no. Get her. Just tell me. You'll never get away with it. <laughs> get off of her, you monsters. Help me. All right. All right. We actually have some work to do. Oh, man. I guess I asked for that, huh? Yep. <laughs> Let's go. So, Jesse wants us to do the creek trails. He's gonna relieve Joel and Tommy. Oh, that's nice you assigned us together. You're gonna <clears> like <throat> this route. Oh, well, before we do anything, we're just gonna end off here. Because I feel like we're gonna have a n really good action pack in the next part. Anyway, I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, it is a little shorter than the last, you know, first part of the last game. But I do hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, follow me on my Twitter for channel updates. Because I post up there, you know, whenever something goes wrong and uploads. Anyway, uh, we're just going to end it here. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.